Greenlandic snow crab is one of the finest delicacies of the Arctic regions. It's known for its leg and claw meat, rectangular pieces of soft meat, bright orange on the outside and snow white on the inside. The flavor is pleasantly sweet and intense and can be eaten alone with a piece of bread or as a luxury ingredient in a wealth of dishes. Snow crab lives in the coldest parts of the Pacific and the Atlantic Oceans. It's characterized by its bright orange shell and long legs. Males can reach a leg span of up to 90 centimeters and a shell diameter of up to 17 centimeters. The females are smaller and are not caught commercially, but are left to reproduce and secure future snow crab generations. In Greenland, the snow crab fishery is along the west coast. Snow crab is caught whenever the sea is ice-free and the yearly quota permits, normally from March to December. Snow crab is caught the old-fashioned way, with pots. The pot is a metal frame covered with netting. They're baited with fish or squid and lowered to the seabed where the crabs live. On the top of the pot, there's a small opening that's designed so that the crab can enter but not leave. On arrival at the fishing ground, the fisherman lowers the baited pots to the seabed and leaves them to fish. After three or four hours, the pots are hauled on board the vessel and the crabs taken out. Should any females or juveniles have crawled into the pot, they're immediately released back into the sea. The crabs are then placed in boxes and topped off with ice to keep them at their normal temperature. Only males with a shell diameter above 10 centimeters are taken to shore. Royal Greenland operates three crab processing factories along the Greenlandic west coast in Bamut, Sisimut, and Gagadasuak on Disco Island. The crabs are landed alive at the factory. On arrival, the first step is to evaluate the size and quality of the crabs. If a crab is too small or dead on arrival, it will be rejected. The slaughtering is done by hand, as humanely as possible. The crab is held firmly by the legs, and with a quick movement, the body is knocked apart and the crab instantly killed. The shoulder and leg sections are then cleaned of entrails, gills and mouthpieces, and cooked in fresh water for approximately 18 minutes, until they obtain a core temperature of 85 degrees Celsius. After cooking, the crab sections are slowly cooled down in cold water for approximately 35 minutes. They're then brined in a saturated saltwater solution that's cooled down to minus 18 degrees Celsius. Next, they're run through a flow freezer to reach a core temperature of minus 18 degrees C. Finally, the crabs are glazed with fresh water to protect them against drying out during transport. Before packaging, the crabs undergo a final quality check to ensure a uniform quality. The crabs are then carefully folded and packed in cardboard master cartons that are lined with plastic. From there, the crabs are taken to the freezer storage, ready for dispatch to consumers across the world consumers who are in for a true Greenlandic treat. <laughs>